Pemirsa yang menyaksikan segmen khusus CNBC Indonesia Tech Talk bersama saya Safri dan Nasution. Di kesempatan ini kita akan berdiskusi bagaimana data dan juga kecerdasan buatan atau AI bisa memberikan perubahan yang signifikan dan juga perbaikan tentunya terhadap masa depan dari kesehatan di Indonesia. The Futures of Indonesian Healthcare. Dan telah bergabung bersama kami secara eksklusif di CNBC Indonesia, Luciano Brustia, Regional Managing Director Asia Pacific from InterSystem. How are you, Luciano? Thank you so much for joining us in CNBC. Thank you so much for having me here. All good. To start off our interview, uh, please um, let us know about InterSystem, what your company do and um, what are kind of solutions that you provide to uh, the society. Yeah. So InterSystem is a private company. It uh, was founded by Terry Reagan uh, um, in, uh, in Boston in 1978. Uh, mm. And uh, from there has been a technology company focusing uh, on providing uh, the best technology possible, mm. the faster and more, uh, most reliable technology to build creative solution. Mm. And uh, from 1978, uh, uh, the company has always been remained uh, private. We always are uh, interested in engaging in a long-term relationship with all our customers and all our employees. Think that I'm 29 years uh, that I'm working in InterSystem. I know I look very young, <laughs> uh, but it's 29 years I'm working in InterSystem. In InterSystem. So that was first established in Boston, 1970. Correct. What was the first mission and the vision for um, InterSystems? for um, healthcare especially? Yeah, so we are a technology company, mm -hmm. but uh, uh, we've been very successful on building solution, in particular in uh, healthcare. Mm -hmm. And this is where we probably are most uh, popular all around the world and most well known. Our presence uh, in, uh, in Asia, in Asia Pacific, uh, is back from 25 years. Mm -hmm. uh, and we have uh, uh, been successful uh, in installing all our uh, solution in hospital, in healthcare solution, but not only, also yeah. in logistics, mm. uh, all around Asia, of course, all, all the rest of the world, but with the focus of Asia and Asia Pacific. Well, wonderful, wonderful mm. stories that you have in InterSystem. Luciano, what do you think about the healthcare industries in um, developing countries, especially like Indonesia? Well, healthcare is a very important part. Mm -hmm. um, if you if you wanted to quote my mama and my grandmother, <laughs> two things are important in life, yeah. health and money. So healthcare is the most important one because money can come, but, but health is very important to keep and we have only one body. Mm. And um, uh, you know, uh, Asia in this moment, uh, it's very diverse. Yeah. Uh, but if we focus on Indonesia, you are in a very important part uh, of the completely new uh, challenge in front of you. Mm -hmm. uh, you are the fourth uh, largest population in the world, 280, 290 million uh, population. Very difficult uh, area because it's a three or four time zone yeah. with a lot of island, difficult to reach, uh, and a very young population. So this means, uh, and another very important information is that uh, the uh, expectation of life uh, has been increased a lot. Uh, this means uh, that we will bring more and more uh, chronic disease mm -hmm. arriving soon. Yeah. And uh, you needed to have a health system ready to treat this. Mm -hmm. Nowadays, there are only in, in Indonesia, probably 50, around 50,000 specialists. Mm -hmm. is a very small number right. of doctors. And where is the technology really needed to help uh, on maximize the help to provide to this 50,000 heroes, uh, specialists that need to provide a service mm -hmm. to a, such a large yeah. population. How can access to um, reliable data and also artificial intelligence will specifically help these um, issues that are unique to um, emerging economies like Indonesia? Yeah. So artificial intelligence Everyone talking about the artificial yeah. intelligence. And uh, you need to be ready. Mm -hmm. And to be ready, you need to have a strong foundation. Mm -hmm. The data are the foundation. Mm -hmm. And uh, speaking the same language is another important foundation. Yeah, for sure. 
because uh, the data it should be easy to communicate mm -hmm. because uh, the AI model, mm -hmm. all these beautiful things, they need to run on trustable model, on data that are uh, sure, and they are speaking the same language uh, with the same unique uh, code. I don't enter in uh, too much technicism uh, with the healthcare, but it's very important to call the same way the same things. Mm -hmm. So I can explain you that I have uh, I seen today in, in, in the street uh, a, a white horse uh, with a black stripe. You understand I'm talking about the zebra. Mm -hmm. And you are telling me that you have seen a black horse uh, with, with white uh, and oh. is a zebra. We understand. <laughs> Data don't understand. Mm -hmm. So this is when you need to talk a convention. And this is where we have a help uh, with our technology, government around the world are adopting standard that yeah. call that animal zebra. Mm -hmm. So, so having the same language yeah. for the accessible data and AI also, you think is very important. Absolutely, and this is what uh, the government the government is doing with the Satus Art. Mm -hmm. Okay, my my small uh, understanding uh, of Bahasa means that the Satu is one, mm -hmm. Seat is health, so one health. Mm -hmm. S starting in the emergency condition of the COVID, uh, but now you have a very solid, a good um, basement. Uh, for all this data. Yeah. And this is where it's very important uh, that all the hospitals are populating yeah. this uh, base. So we have adopted our technology mm -hmm. to be to use the standard of Satuseat yeah. and to provide uh, to hospital a, 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 a to other uh, health organization uh, a solid interface uh, to this government. Mm -hmm. and when, yeah. When InterSystem uh, started uh, the business in 1978, it was a technological company. Correct. But there must be some reasons why InterSystem, um, the majority of their services and products are for healthcare systems and healthcare industry all over the world. Any reason for that, sir? Healthcare need to be trustable, mm -hmm. reliable, and fast. Mm -hmm. You know, you go to the supermarket, uh, the technology is down. Yeah, huh? okay. <laughs> You go to the bank, uh, the technology is, is down, okay, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, but in, healthcare... In healthcare, you, you have the blood to be exam, uh, and that blood, the result to be there, and mm -hmm. should be 100% reliable. Mm -hmm. And this is where we believe uh, we have made the difference. And in particular, mm -hmm. in what the healthcare call interoperability. Yeah. So connecting different data together mm. and connecting in when you go in one hospital, you don't need to go in different department and mm. saying, oh, I am Luciano. Yeah. This is my date of birth. Then you go in and from the nurse, oh, I am Luciano. This is my date of birth. Mm. Connectivity, interoperability, this data pass easy and you don't need to ask the same information as twice. So that was the solid answer is that you have why the technology from InterSystem this is mostly for the healthcare, something that is essential. Yes. Something. So it's, uh, you know, as usual, the most beautiful things are the most easy and the yeah. most simple. Mm -hmm. And the simplicity of using our technology is that is the secret. Well, wonderful. Now about the data. We often hear that um, data is a new oxygen for healthcare, uh, but in a fragmented systems, how do you ensure that uh, this reliable data actually flows safely and meaningfully, not only within hospital, but also across the whole ecosystem supporting healthcare? Well, we were talking about the Satu Seat before. Mm -hmm. That is a very good example okay. of how this can be done. And um, technology nowadays can be secure. Mm -hmm. You can secure your data. Is 100% secure never. Mm -hmm. There is always the possibility, and this is why the technology needs to be updated and keep to be updated. But having this, the same data uh, platform, a solid, strong data platform mm -hmm. that enable uh, automatically all this data being read uh, by AI to help uh, understanding this data is the secret. Mm 